The Naga People's Front (NPF) is a regional political party in Nagaland and Manipur, India. It headed the Nagaland government with the Bharatiya Janata Party as part of the Democratic Alliance of Nagaland since 2003. Dr. Shirhozeli Lizetsu is the president of the party. Till the 16th of January 2018, Nafu Rio, the Lok Sabha member from the lone constituency of Nagaland, was the main leader of the party. On the 22nd of March 2004, the NPF absorbed the Nagaland Democratic Party. Topic: History. Prior to October 2002, the party was known as Nagaland People's Council (NPC). The name of the party was changed from Nagaland People's Council (NPC) to Nagaland People's Front (NPF) in the 9th General Convention held at Kohima in October 2002. This historic decision found wide acceptance among the people of the state, as a popular wish of the state was to modify the leadership of the state and make it more inclusive. In Nagaland, both the ruling Naga People's Front and the opposition party, the UPA, supported Pranab Mukherjee during the 2012 presidential election. Mukherjee held a meeting with Nafu Rio and Dan legislators in Damapur where NPF leaders formally endorsed their support. Mukherjee won the election on 19 July 2012. When the Nagaland Post asked the chief minister, Nafu Rio, if the support extended to the presidential candidate was also issue-based. As the NPF led Dan was supporting the UPA government at the centre on the same line, the chief minister said that his party was supporting the UPA and hence it was the right perspective that the Dan legislators also support UPA's presidential nominee. NPF's main opposition in the Legislative Assembly is the Indian National Congress Party. Although the Naga People's Front has local arrangements with the NDA it previously had not support either the NDA or the UPA in the central government where it has one MP in the Lok Sabha. For the 2014 general election, the Northeast Regional Political Front NERPF, a consortium of ten regional parties, including the Naga People's Front announced their support for the NDA. Currently it is a part of Northeast Regional Political Front consisting of political parties of the Northeast which has supported the National Democratic Alliance India. On the 11th of May 2015, all of the Assembly's Congress MLAs joined the NPF. 46 MLAs from the 60-member Nagaland Legislative Assembly are from the NPF. The opposition, Congress, is represented by 18 MLAs and the rest of the Assembly consists of seven independent MLAs. In May 2016, after the Bharatiya Janata Party-led National Democratic Alliance formed its first government in Assam, a new alliance called the Northeast Democratic Alliance NEDA was formed with Hemanta Biswa Sarma as its convener. The chief ministers of the northeastern states of Sikkim, Assam, Arunachal Pradesh and Nagaland too belong to this alliance. Thus, the Naga People's Front joined the BJP-led NEDA. Aims and objectives The aims and objectives of the Naga People's Front are a, to work and assist in any possible manner on any approach for a peaceful solution of the Indo-Naga political issue, keeping alive at the same time the fire of relentless endeavor to stand against any force to further divide the Nagas and thereby move towards a renaissance of Naga Brotherhood by making constant appeal to Naga conscience. B. To strive to bring about electoral reforms suited to our way of life aimed at a national resurgence in the society towards whom the party is duty-bound and thereby to liberate the Naga society from the deadly clutches of degeneration. C. To work for unity and integrity of the people by integrating all contiguous Naga inhabited areas under one administrative roof and also to provide protection to all the ethnic groups who are indigenous inhabitants of the state. D. To restore the good name and clean image which the Nagas enjoyed in the past by taking the fight against all forms of corruption at all levels of government. E. To restore to the people the self-discipline and the spirit of self-reliance which the Nagas had in abundance in the past but which have been seriously eroded in the recent past. F. To work for economic advancement of the people with special emphasis on rural development with a view to removing economic disparity in the society. G. To strive for a clean and efficient administration. H. To strictly abide by the rule of law in the dispensation of justice. Topic: <laughs> List of chief ministers. Topic. <laughs> 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 
Topic See also Y. Hewoto Awomi